And if they're going to play that game, I just get ultra aggressive. Anomaly, good map. So since we're 3v3, we'll want to group up as much as we can. Um, since there's multiple snipers, the shotgunner is going to be more aggressive. His name is... Babonitz? Babonitz? I don't know what that person's name is. Skirmish. And the Bravo other two team. are going to want to snipe for the most part. They're going to camp on that. Oh, one just switched to a sidearm. Get your head in the fight, so across, God. not this section, but across the, the map essentially is the catwalk. And so the sniper is going to want to hang out over here. They're heading over to the main area. Um, they may be following me. Okay, but bonus is down. Gained the lead. Come across catwalk. Okay, so should be able to pick up the blueberry. Oh, blueberry. Teammate. Okay. You move around a little bit so you can get shot in the head. Do you know how to push? You probably haven't been done a lot of 3v3, is my guess. Okay. So if you do a revive, you want to keep an eye out for any red spots on the the radar that indicates that there's a sniper. Okay, so there's one in this cave here. So I'm not going to go in there. Oh, teammate. I like you. That is badass. Our blueberry uses invis, which is amazing for doing a revive or attacking. It's not very common in PvP. So when you push, is you, you hold the square to revive somebody when they're dead. Alright, I'm going to go around. He's right above us. You can see that red circle. I'm just going to abandon our dead teammate. Okay. down. I knew where he was, and honestly, since we pushed at the same time, it made it pretty tough. So I'm going to revive you, and here's an example. I'm going to push you. See that? So they aren't even snipe you. Okay, I got two of them on me. To your right. Oh. That's alright. Oh, we each lost a teammate. How funny. So we're 2v2. So you can go ahead and respawn yourself. I'm going to wait for you so we can both get the special. Alright, so I'm going to pull special. If I pull it before you spawn up, you won't get the special ammo. So I'm going to go around to that catwalk I was talking about. This is the... over here is the engine room. That's what everybody nicknames it. Nick, Nick names it. Where's he at? Oh, I'm back to him. That was badass. So there's special ammo over here. Okay. I'll hop past doorways usually. So this box that you can see on the map is green is underneath here again. So a lot of times I'll use I'll special star people. It's kind of a shitty thing to do, but whatever. PvP. So now I'm going to go ahead and shoot. Oh. Guardian down. Sorry about that. You're falling behind. He's dead. I can get you. So every revive is worth 50 points. He's up above. On, uh, not catwalk on the table. No, he's down to ground, ground level now. Is he? No. I'm mistaken. He thinks it right there. Okay, I'm gonna come back to you in a second. I'll wait for the tether to go away. What's your timer like? Okay, that's fine. So he wasted his tether. 
he died, he didn't make it work for his teammate, and then I fusioned him anyway. Nice! I'm coming to help. Heavy ammo on the way. Dang! Down. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna pick you up and we're gonna run for this heavy that's in this cave right next to us. I got heavy machine guns, so if this goes well, we'll own them for quite a while. Alright, so typically what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab it, both are live, and now's a good time to use a super if you have it. Not necessarily if they have a rocket, but like in my case I'm using a tether. Because if I can kill them, then they don't have ammo. This guy is down. Oh, we got both. They have no heavy ammo now. Sorry, we know they spawned across the map. So they are at the, um, not the catwalk, but the, uh, across the table is what people call it. So I'm gonna make some biz so we can take a peek. He's on the catwalk now. He's got a sword. Oh, they get another teammate. So in memory, the sword. He's gonna want to sneak up on us. So he's gonna go crouchy a lot. It's a hunter. I'm gonna grab the special just because. That was an enemy blade. Oh, it's it's your blade. You're kicking ass. That means Double kill. All right, get our teammate up. One of the other tricks with invisibility I can't do now. Oh, he auto spawn or he rushes spawn. Is if you go to invis some or revive somebody right before they stand Push up, the you throw an invisibility smoke Don't down. Give them a chance to recover. He's underneath. Guardian down. Back up just a hair. Sometimes in that scenario I didn't want to push because I'm not uh Very nice. Very nice. One behind us. We're coming from the catwalk area. Oh, shoulder charged me. Should have had him. Okay, you're okay for now. He went down below. He's probably falling. <laughs> Exciting. He's gonna bring in a smash pretty soon. That striker's probably got it by now. Guardian down. 
Somebody on you. Dang. Oh, I had to pick myself up. But he had a golden gun. So uh, one of the other pretty normal tips is simply if you're hurt, recover. This person just off the map? Another battle won. On to the next fight. Yeah, that one Titan uh, ran past me. And I was like, oh crap, I'm trying to recover. And he turned around to come back and get me. And uh, I think I just lost him for a second. I don't know, he didn't hit me. So what do you think? What do you think of three v three? It's pretty fun. Um, skirmish can be now. Occasionally you run into like really strong players, nicknamed sweaty players. <laughs> <laughs> 